A controversial unemployment bill is now law. Governor McCrory signed the bill in Gaston County this morning that requires people who receive unemployment benefits to increase their contacts with potential employers from two to five times a week. Time Warner Cable News anchor Christina Watkins joins us now with more on what the governor had to say about the law. Christina. And Rob, Governor Pat McCrory says make North Carolina more competitive. He also says the whole point of it all is, quote, helping people who can't help themselves while encouraging others who can. <laughs> Governor Pat McCrory filled with excitement Thursday morning as he signed a bill that he says is a game changer when it comes to unemployment benefits. Getting a job is a job and you should treat it as a job. Senate Bill 15 is an unemployment legislation that changes a lot, like requiring people to show a valid federal ID when collecting unemployment benefits. A photo ID will ensure that the person who deserves and qualifies for the benefits is the same person who is getting the check. It also allows them to check criminal justice databases to make sure inmates aren't applying for unemployment benefits, which actually happened two years ago in the state. In 2012, three Swain County jail inmates were collecting unemployment payments while they were locked up. That's not acceptable. One of the big changes, people getting unemployment benefits now have to make five job contacts a week. That's up from the previously required two. The five contacts can be also done via the Internet. But most importantly, Governor McCrory says it'll help people find jobs quicker so they can get back on their feet. I care for the people who are uh, trying to find employment. And we want you to also, we want to help you, but we also want you to help yourself. And something else that was kind of interesting about today's signing was Governor McCrory talked about the time he was actually laid off from his job when he was 31 years old. Now, that only lasted for about two weeks, but he referenced it just to make a point that he understands what it's like to not have a job. And he hopes this uh, new bill will make that process for people in the state a little bit easier. Reporting in Gastonia, Christina Watkins, Time Warner Cable News. State lawmakers are getting close.